Much of schoolwork is drills. Typical maths homework is a random set of problems. Those in a set, like double digit subtraction, are all usually given equal weight and summed, even though they may actually vary in difficulty. This is called random parallel forms, which we'll discuss in more detail later. To liven up the drills over the years, teachers have developed all sorts of activities. Story puzzles to give meaning to the calculations, field trips, science fairs, movies, and in our era, computer games, mathletic competitions, and countless nifty iPad apps. The main alternatives are adaptation and modification of an existing commercial game or a template which allows teachers and students to create or customize a game. This course focuses on creating and customizing your own game. The perspective we are adding is embedding these nifty little apps into a larger whole, which I term a metagame. In other words, the crossword puzzles and quizzes I showed in the first modules are what I would term gamelets, little mini-games. The course is the metagame. The gamelets could be apps, shoot 'em up arcade games, crosswords, a quiz, draw a picture, change a picture, make a movie, or whatever. In themselves, they have limited educational value. The skill of the games master is to embed these in a metagame. We're familiar with this. The Olympics is a collection of dozens of sports. A tournament is a collection of contests. A college degree is a collection of subjects. A modern web quest or computer game may have a wide range of cognitive and physical competitions. The individual gamelets form the metagame. Our working lives can be regarded as a metagame. A lifelong sequence of daily tasks and challenges. Each of these is a gamelet in the metagame of a career. So for homework, think of some gamelets and describe how we might string them together to make a meaningful metagame. Think about TV shows that follow this formula. 